Hi everyone, today I'd like to do an amazing swap haul and this is from my favourite swapper and she's on YouTube, although she doesn't post as often as she should um, she does really good reviews and that's how I discovered her so um, obviously I'll put her link below and definitely subscribe I've already tried a couple of things and literally she has the best taste the first thing which I've already got one of these and one I've got I think is called Foreplay, I believe. It's a peachy one. I'm definitely going to have both of these as my top favourites when I come to do my favourites videos soon. And this is Rockin' Republic and I have no idea where to get these in England. If anyone knows, please let me know. These are just fantastic. I'm not that keen on the packaging, it's a tiny bit gaudy but great big mirror and the actual colours, fantastic, pigmented, really smooth, lasts all day and I just can't say anything bad. I just think these are the best blushes that I've ever used and I've used quite a few so absolutely adore this. Thank you. This one is in Kinky and as you saw it's a really really neon looking pink first I thought well it might be a bit too bold for me I've used it and it actually comes out quite soft and I'm wearing it now in fact but I'm not sure if it will pick up on camera but it's a very natural colour if you just use a little the next thing which I've heard a lot about via reviews on YouTube is by Sue Devitt and this is one of her famous pencils and this one is called Eye Intensifier Pencil in, in Kalahari and it's, I've used it already, it's like a slate grey and it's really nice and soft, pigmented and it's got a smudger here so really like that, it, it looks like that, really good colour good for smoky eyes and I actually use this as an eyeshadow base and it really didn't crease I'll show you what I used it with in a second so I'm really excited about that um, I got three of these Wet n Wild palettes and I've been wanting these for so long and I use the Sue Devitt pencil with Comfort Zone the Club dupe and it really is a club dupe, it's brilliant, it's got that duochrome to it and I would not know the difference, in fact it might even be smoother than MAC Club, so really love that, looking forward to trying all of these. And I also got Petal Pusher and I got Blue Had Me At Hello, which in French is Je Le Bleu, so I think that's more like I've got the blues. But either way, really nice blues here, really amazing turquoise, can't wait to try that, so excellent, excellent palette. And I got three nail polishes, I haven't tried this yet, but this one looks my absolute favourite. It's a really beautiful, um, it's a really beautiful sort of grey purple almost, with pink in it. Really, it's really unusual, and this one's called Brizia. And then I've got this one, which is a silver pale shade called Laney. And then I've got this one, which is called Brook, which is a really nice, bright, almost looks duochrome actually, bright pink. So really excited to try them out. I'm actually wearing my Chanel nail polish at the moment and I'm so disappointed in it. It just chips almost instantly. Zoya are a lot better, I'm afraid. So looking forward to trying these out very soon. I got a baby pomegranate soap, which looks really nice. I'm looking forward to trying that. And, which I've already had a bath with this. As soon as I got it, I just ran a bath and tried this out. I love Ahava. It's a really good brand. It's from the Dead Sea in Israel. And it's just really high quality, good for your skin. And this one is smells so good, really nice. Um, this one is in mandarin and cedarwood, and it's bath salts. So I love that. Really, really relaxing bath. I personally I love baths more than showers. So 
that's very useful. Then I've got three of these mask packs which look really specialised and this is called Black Pearl Mask and it looks uh, Japanese I think, I don't know, um, Japanese or Chinese, I think Japanese but I'm not sure. Um, anyway, these look really good and I'm excited to try this out. So that's that. And then I got this new toothpaste and and I actually use um, Rembrandt toothpaste which is also quite an expensive toothpaste and apparently this one is really expensive but Antonia said it was really good so I'm looking forward to trying that because um, my teeth are not my best feature and um, it's a bit like Rembrandt because it's got that old fashioned quality to it but this is definitely the most elegant tube of toothpaste that I've ever seen in fact I haven't opened it yet but yeah so that is just so elegant and old fashioned I just love that it looks excellent I'm really looking forward to giving that a go probably might be my favourite part but I shouldn't say that and Honia has got amazing taste in music and in fact I would say that after watching her videos, literally, um, my music taste has kind of changed lately. It used to be much more rock and um, small independent labels and stuff like that and I still like that a lot but since listening to um, music in Antonia's videos and getting into a bit of hip hop I've just started listening to Tim Westwood and stuff like that, which is a UK um, DJ. Also in large part to uh, Antonio making me CDs in the past, which I've really enjoyed. So I've got a whole load of CDs and I'm really looking forward to trying all of these. Thank you so, so much for this. Honestly, I'm just excited to listen to these because I really like mix CDs and I like it when people make me mix CDs. So, um, yeah, there's Mike Posner, Far East Movement, Bruno Mars, Miguel, Chris Brown, Britney Spears, and Christina Grimmel. Not sure. Um, but anyway, I'm looking forward to opening my musical horizons. So, thank you again, Antonia. Really do adore this. It was just such a wonderful package to open and I'm sure you'll agree that she's been so kind, generous and thoughtful and I'm just excited for the next swap and hopefully you get my swap soon as well so let me know. Um, yeah, that's it. So hope you enjoyed and I'll talk to you all soon. All the best. Bye.